if it represents racism to a lot of people, then I would say it's like maybe not a good thing to keep them around. Love that, love that. What about you? If it's an issue for people, they should probably be removed. Cool, cool, cool. Love it. Okay. These memorials are prominent Southern figures. Um, sometimes it's good to remember, like, that that was a dark time. It might be good to look at them in, um, maybe as a warning, almost. It's interesting to see the you know variety of opinions that BYU students had on if Confederate statues should be removed from prominent places across the U.S. One of the things that I think sticks out the most to me just off, you know, just straight reaction is that it's really not a, an issue that people think about. I don't want to say like more important than mine, but like they're experiencing like a harder like reality in that sense than I am. So I think I should like kind of go to like what how they feel about it rather than how I feel about it because I'm not experiencing the same things that they're experiencing in their life experiences right so majority of the people said yeah I mean if it's offensive to people maybe we should go ahead and lock them down and then even the people who said that maybe we shouldn't keep them up or get rid of them you know thought that maybe we should put them into a museum or keep them up as like a reminder of dark times as you just saw but, you know, it's definitely not something that people within that age group, within that college age group are particularly worked up about. You know, obviously those students are looking at the job market they're going into. They're just trying to, you know, figure their dating lives out and things like that, which, again, kind of goes to show that the, the, the whole uproar um, that Fox News and other outlets similar uh, make about these issues is really just a big smoke show. You know, you have a pocket of people who are really passionate about keeping them up. But for the most part, it's just not a pressing issue for most Americans. In my opinion, I think that it makes sense to remove the statues. I mean, there's no real reason why we have to keep them up. And, you know, over time, there's going to be continued arguments and a continued process on taking them down. But definitely put them in a museum. Definitely put them in places where people can have open access to learning about our history and not just, uh, you know, the bad things that happened during times like slavery, segregation and things along those lines, but also, you know, how people fought against it, what people went through in order to overcome those struggles and things like that. And you know, we can already see that in a lot of museums. So we might as well just go ahead and continue to get with the times and continue to take these statues down because, you know, again, what are we really talking about? I think it would be good to remove them from public places, um, like from parks and town halls, and maybe keep them in museums. Or, okay. Perfect. Love that. Um, I think that's up to the locals, honestly. Like, personally, I, I think so, because, like, a monument is, like, something that you idolize, but I'm also, like, that's not part of my culture. Like, that's not really, I'm not from there, so that's up to the locals. But honestly, if it was like in my town, yeah. yeah. Cool, thank you. So again, instead of focusing on the issues like raising wages and why the wage gap is continuing to increase and who's really to blame for it, of course, Fox News and again, outlets like that OANN and Newsmax and what have you and other various YouTube platforms and whatnot. You know, they'll put these removing of the statues down and people will get all caught up in it because again, it's just entertaining. We know the tactics that the GOP uses and people in the far right wing in America use. So, you know, again, let's continue to push forth the real policy. Let's continue to focus on making sure that we can make all of our lives better. And uh, again, I think it was good to see the BYU students, uh, you know, overall reflection on we should take them down. But in general, you know, again, it's just really not a pressing issue for the coming generations.